usable term here would be objecto art. Um, solid, solid malachite um, with a thin crust of chrysocala over it. Now, in between this crust, I expect to find perhaps some pink cobalt and calcite crystals. Strangely enough, it doesn't seem like there are on this particular one. A um, little bit of calcite, it seems, over there, but not the cobalt and calcite. Uh, uh, Vags of the malachite. Now, the malachite from uh, this particular deposit at Mashamba West doesn't have patterning on the cross section. Um, I think it's it's we we're talking almost primary malachite here, but this is solid malachite ore. So the guys would be mining this to an extent uh, to extract the copper from it because the relative weight of the specimen is quite heavy. So there's a pretty high copper content in the specimen. Of course, malachite is totally stable, so, so there's nothing like uh, it's going to attack your other specimens or it's harmful in any way. Uh, it's it's uh, as stable as it is. It's basically copper, which is oxidizing, or another term for oxidation would be the rusting. Um, accurate color is, is pretty much this. Uh, you'll find in my still pictures, often it appears black. It's actually an intense, rich, dark green, as you see here. From a display point of view, it's like a ship. Uh, uh, definitely artistic uh, aspects to this guy. Um, so we could even look at it from this angle. There's a little bit of calcite trapped in there. Maybe a little bit pink, the calcite. So quite possibly some cobalt and calcite. Matrix at the bottom or cross section like this. This is also quite appealing. And then when you're looking from the top down, we'd have it going around like this. Across like that. All the way from Mashamba West in the Katanga, hellish the photograph yet quite exquisite in hand.